hey guys welcome back to another video i hope you're doing fabulous today if you're new over here welcome to my channel i am alicia kim sit back relax enjoy the vlog and get caught up with some older videos so we can become more familiar with each other and it's my big up crew Guan do 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 you know my love you already right so it's pretty early in the morning but i have an adventure planned for it today if you know me by now I have something planned for most of the days so I realize that apple picking is one of the must do activities for fall so of course I found a farm and luckily I went on their website last night because why were they sold out for most of the time slots guys I was lucky to squeeze into a slot so I made the appointment and I decided I'm getting up early to make sure that I don't miss it because it seemed like picking your own apples is a hot, hot thing to do during this time of the year. So I'm going to go and see what that is all about. And the thing is to, let me put this down for a bit. Let me chit chat for a little bit. A few of you have been asking me, how is it that I'm able to move to a new state and just be up and about and exploring? Especially because you know I went through a very traumatic time last year. If you've been watching me, you know I was down and out. I even took months, couple months break from my YouTube channel. I wasn't working. I was in deep, deep depression to be honest with you, as most of you would already know. And one of the things that really helped me and allowed me to be the woman or the person you are seeing today is therapy, guys. I didn't know what to expect, but I knew I needed to dig my way out of the hole I was in. So I actually used BetterHelp to find a therapist and they are sponsoring this portion of today's video. So thank you so much to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video today so basically i did not know where to turn guys and with therapy i thought having an unbiased professional assess what i've been going through and give me the tools and skills that i needed to move on from it and to learn about myself understand my situation and see a future i thought that was the best decision for me to make so basically how better help works so you would go on it is 100 percent online based so that's one of the things i love because i was able to talk to my therapist right from my phone or my laptop and even days when i didn't feel like being on a video call i could text my therapist so that works out perfectly so you would go online when you're just starting out you would complete a quiz and then you would get matched with a therapist and from there you begin scheduling your therapy sessions if at any time you do not feel comfortable with your therapist you can always change them out at no additional cost and for me personally when I started therapy this was my first time I didn't know where to start I really I think Thought I knew what I was trying to accomplish I knew that I wanted help in navigating my situation I wanted a professional someone who is a third party not a part of what I'm going through to kind of assess everything and give me the tips and skills I would need to overcome but when I actually spoke to my therapist and dive deeper they could tell me, hey, have you ever thought about this? How about this? And it opened my eyes so much. One of the tips that my therapist share with me that I use now, and that's why I'm out and about as much, is whenever I'm feeling stressed or anxious, go outside and connect with nature. And that is the reason I'm so out and about and decide to start just exploring and living life because at the end of everything, I realized that there is life on the opposite end of 
trauma, stress, separation, neglect, there is there was life out there for me. So if you think therapy would be beneficial to you, I will be leaving the link in the description. Go ahead and click on it or you can go to betterhelp.com forward slash Alicia Kim to get a discount on your first month of therapy. Again, I thank you so much to BetterHelp for sponsoring this portion of today's video. I am going to be finishing my tea. I decided to come back in bed just to relax. I'm not going to sleep or anything. I already made my bed. And I want to try making a matcha chai recipe. I've bought matcha chai before, but I've never made it. So I'm going to try and make it on my own an iced matcha chai latte and the reason i'm so inspired to do this i was inside trader joe's and i saw this spicy chai tea latte this so i'm like hmm and then they had the matcha green tea powder so i'm like hmm let me combine the two i've bought it before it does taste good the chai i really like chai Tastes really good. So I'm going to combine it, combine it with the matcha and then I got the the oats creamer, the cinnamon bun one from Trader Joe's as well. I have some agave and I also have almond milk. So the only other thing I'm going to need is ice and a glass. So let me start off by warming some water. And well, I haven't used this before, so I need to open it. Mm. This is what it looks like. It's not as green. And then this is the chai. Didn't even know this is how it looks. Mm, it smells so good. Does it have a scoop? Yep, it has its own little scoop. Does the matcha have a scoop? No, the matcha doesn't have a scoop. So. I'm going to make the snow and then get ready to head out. Let me warm the water and begin frothing up the matcha and the chai. Let me make another glass and start doing this. So just do a spoon of the matcha and warm water then frost that up like i would usually do There's nothing out of the ordinary here get some ice And then pour the almond milk. Of course, you can use regular milk, but you know me. And then I just pour the matcha in. Cool? Cool. Seem easy enough. Then I'm going to do the chai now. I'm going to do one scoop because I really don't know the measurement. Well, the serving size of this is actually two scoops. So to be safe, I'm doing one scoop. And then I'm going to pour a little bit of water in this as well. Maybe that's too much water. Froth this up. And pour that over this. Ooh, it looks good already. Then, we are not done yet. Rinse this out. I am going to do some of the, the oat milk, the cinna, cinnamon bun. And pour that on top. Well, let me mix this up. And do some of the creamer for the top. Oh, 
voila so let me try this it looks good but to be honest it looks like more chai than matcha so I'm wondering if I used too much of the chai well let me try it But I'm tasting more chai than matcha. So either I should have done more matcha, which I don't think so. I think I should have done less chai, but it tastes really good. Oh, I need to put a little bit of cinnamon on top for the vibes. Top tier. Top, top tier. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead now and get ready. So let me go find something to put on, get dressed for the day. Made it to the farm guys it's pennings farm and basically the farm is huge luckily i made a reservation because they are sold out today when i drove up they were like no walk-ins only reservation so luckily i made the reservation and did not come up here because they would turn me back but the farm is huge a lot of people out here picking i see honey crisp over there you know i'm getting a few of those so yeah basically you just pick your own apples so you're paying to do labor basically but it's fun it's a nice little fall activity here and i told you i was going to take you apple picking and here we are so i'm going to go pick up my bags and uh, yeah get some apples so let's go check it out and see got my bag it's a small little bag but i'm going to load it up fill it up stuff it with apples the farm is huge though and a lot of people out here I guess this is a, their time of year when they make that extra money from people like us that love the little festivities them done the apple <laughs> the people them done the apple them the tree is empty where are the apples <laughs> Up here, so uh, can't reach. No one. It's a big. I got a few other golden delicious. So I'm doing well so far.
those look really nice and juicy though. So in the bag, it's an experience. I'm not going to say it's not fun. It's an experience. It's different. It's different. Got one in the bag.